One of the skills that I think is most important to have is communication skills. So being able to communicate good verbally and in writing. This is because in my role, I'm constantly sending out emails, writing documents and calling people. When I was in school, I loved creating presentations, presenting and taking part in group discussions. And I think this really helped me to develop my communication skills, which then helped me to get my job. Another skill that is important to have is ICT. And this is just basically being able to use softwares like Microsoft PowerPoint, Microsoft Word, um, I was never the best at ICT in school, but I was able to learn this on the job. Another skill that I learned on the job was organisation skills. And at first, this was something that I struggled with because I didn't know how to manage my time by myself or manage um, the work that I was given. But I was able to learn some new ways to do these from my team members and line manager. In my job, it's important to have a wide range of skills. I would say that possibly one of the most important, if not the most important one, is being a good problem solver. Sometimes, even though you do go out of your way for guests, they might be unhappy with something that has happened, they might be unhappy with the room allocation, they might be unhappy with the service. So you need to tackle those issues straight away. You need to understand the guests, you need to listen to them, you need to do your best to make sure that they leave happy so that it doesn't lead to negative reviews, so that it doesn't lead to, I guess, asking for a refund, and then this costing the business money. I would say that time management as well is incredibly important, so whenever there is a guest request, we need to make sure that it's communicated to the relevant departments, such as a room service order, so that the guest is not waiting an hour and an hour and a half for their food. I would say that school has helped me a lot in time management because you have deadlines all the time, that you need to meet otherwise you will get in trouble uh, if you don't get your studies done in time if you don't get your exams done correctly if you don't get your homework done in time correctly so in my industry it changes all the time so there's going to be a load of different skills and personality traits you're going to need to be successful some of them being you need to be really good at technology so you know how to use devices maybe you know how to solve a few problems being adaptive adapted to change when i first started in phones uh, we had really basic um, really basic screens and curved displays wasn't even a thing so actually adapting to that and learning about all the new technologies that are coming out is really really important and also problem solving sometimes you're just going to approach a approach a, an issue and you're not going to know what, what the issue is and how to resolve it so the ability then to think on the spot think outside the box and really get to the the nitty and gritty and work out what's going on is really really important <laughs>